this is Chuck and uh, really appreciate you taking some time to stop by my shop. Uh, as you can see, I'm dressed up, beard, got my jacket on. It's, uh, what is it right now? Well, it's 65 outside right now. It was 30, 38 this morning. Uh, but anyway, enough of that. The, uh, this video is going to be about the uh, new laser that I have here in my shop. It was sent to me to do a demo on it. Uh, it's the Jakota and it's a 10-watt laser. And a uh, little disclaimer here, um, I am an amateur at using the laser uh, and using light burn, uh, but I'm having quite a bit of fun with it. And uh, I got a few different uh, videos to show you here. Um, they were taken with my phone and uh, we'll step through them. So one of the uh, first, first ones I did was uh, I've got a set of parallels, large parallels here, and uh, you might be able to see where I where I've actually laser etched the uh, size into them. They're just an odd set, and uh, let's uh, click over to that video. Okay, we're back from that video, and after doing that, uh, boy, I couldn't stop myself now, and uh, here's a uh, pair of uh, more 1, 2, 3 blocks, and uh, I picked these up, they, when I purchased them from the fella, he said that the uh, 1 inch dimension, they weren't, they, they weren't on. So I ground them, and they're a match set now. The two and three dimensions are right on. It was the one inch dimension that was off. So let's flip to a video on that also and the laser. So, uh, come on up here. Come on. Come on. Come on. You want to come up here? Come on. Oh, is he going to get in the video? Eh, you can see him. The hound dog had to come in here. Okay, Howie. I got to get back at the video. Okay, go. Go. All right, we'll stay back here. So, the, uh, couldn't stop there, though. Couldn't stop there. So, I have a set of half parallels. And if you don't have a set of half parallels, uh, you got to make yourself a set. You know, at a garage sale, a machinist shop, buy a set of parallels, cut them in half. And I went through and marked them all. So a uh, little video on that. We'll take a peek at that.
and uh, we're back from that. In the in the past, I've shown with the previous uh, laser I had, where I cut out a holly carburetor. I had done uh, gaskets where I've burned them in the paper, and uh, where I've actually uh, made myself a stencil. Um, lots of things like that. Well, I tried burning sheet metal, uh, not in the fact to cut it, but to etch it for layout. So I have, I've got this little drawing right here. And what I did is I copied, I first, uh, to truth be told, first I actually, f with a photocopier, took a photocopy, put it into Lightburn, and was using Lightburn to edit um, the document. Too much stuff on there to keep cleaning off. Uh, so I said, wait a minute, you know, it's a simple drawing. I can draw it in Fusion. So I drew it in Fusion real quick. And then uh, let's go to a video. Okay, you're back from that video, and you'll notice that uh, it did a great layout on the on the um, sheet metal. I did paint the sheet metal with uh, Rust-Oleum called chalk, um, clear matte, and that's what burnt the lines in really well. Um, I initially forgot to do the half-inch diameter circles, and when I picked it up to tell it to do that, I actually didn't mean to, but it did a line and fill, and then I looked and went, oh hell, let's go with the line and fill. So that worked out well, and you can see a couple of photos of that. I think I'll click them in there. And from there, well, there it is. So it was, uh, I'm not going to show you uh, cutting and, and uh, sheet metal bending, but um, it, uh, it certainly was easier in a layout situation having the laser mark the uh, product up to bend and cut and drill uh, rather than sitting there with a uh, square and, and uh, scribe. So where does that leave us? Uh, I just want to tell you I'm really happy with this machine. It came shipped, uh, double shipped in a box. The uh, packaging and everything was fantastic on it. Uh, the operations manual that comes with it is very, very limited. It looks, uh, there's a lot of units that look very similar, similar to this, and uh, it's very possible that it's just a, a generic manual. I got one more thing. I'm not uh, a very artsy guy, um, but uh, you'll see a video of this. Uh, this is my uh, son's girlfriend and her new puppy, a chow. And uh, I took uh, a photo of her and fooled around learning how to etch it into tile and writing the uh, burns. Let's take a peek at that.
Okay, well, we're back from that. Uh, maybe I'll be making Christmas gifts. I, I don't know. But hey, uh, honestly, uh, I'm not an artsy guy. Um, I'm really enjoying the laser and uh, learning and trying to extend its use in the shop for marking tooling or marking drawings. Uh, I might even look at uh, some machine layouts, uh, machinist layouts, and see if, uh, if that makes sense also. All right, I've gotten enough of your time. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, learned something from it. And uh, Thanksgiving's coming up, so happy Thanksgiving if you don't see me before then. And uh, again, appreciate your time. Take care.